Welcome to the Ancient Ruins, filled with Lamu Lana style music, lots of horrible, frustrating puzzles, deadly enemies. Kind of like the last dungeon, actually. It's deadly, it's awesome, it's better than the water temples from the Ages game. Good fun. Some annoying spinner stuff, so we'll have to do lots of backtracking and looping around. I think I can handle that. Yeah, I don't think I'll really use the shield much in, in favor of the feather. Or the boomerang if you want to kill mummies, for sure. Boomerang's great. That chest of pass has like one rupee or five rupees in it. Something not worth it. And there's lots of rooms like these where you don't really have to kill anything. There we go. We want to go west and get a key. To unlock that block and we can move around freely. Now this, surprisingly enough, is going to be one of the most frustrating rooms in the entire dungeon. And it's just from one little thing, well after this guy leaves, um, one little thing that, I don't know if it's a glitch or it's intentional, but either way it's really frustrating. Oops. Don't let it fall in the hole there. That's the first point. Well, I just did, but oh well. Yeah, I don't know why this guy always gets caught on it, but you can't trick him into being stuck there. Now this is the trick, is that if the ball hits the edge of the screen while you're pushing it, it will basically fall into the hole. It's like by hitting the edge of the screen. If you, don't, if you don't let go of the button, at least that's my experience. But also, if you walk into the pit, so it, is, it falls in too. So you kind of have to rush it to the edge enough so that you can see the other side of the screen. Like so. I know I made it look easy, but I've failed in that like six, five or six times at a row before. I actually had to restart this video once for that. Just because if you stand back here and you shove it, and you even if you keep holding on and try to do this, it'll hit the edge of the screen and die. It's just game over. So that's a neat trick of this thing. I like doing that. But anyway. <clears throat> now, let's go south here. Collect the map on the way. I think it's either, either the map or the compass up here. I'm not gonna go to the left quite yet. There's other stuff to do first. Yeah, so that key basically gives us free reign to the uh, to this spinny spinner wheel thing. So we can do this. So I might as well unlock this. Or throw this on the button, I mean, because it should stay put. Yeah, that should stay put for quite a while. So get that out of the way. Okay. say so. Nothing to think about, just kind of do it. This room's fun. I like this room. Makes you work for it, you know? Ah, ah. Uh, not once, but twice. That's more like it. Oh, yeah. Stuff. That's all I 
came here for. It's kind of a dead end anyway. You can't go south from that one room, so. Oh, I jumped over that. Come on. And I swung my sword at the bat. What, I swung over the bat? Was the bat not flying? I don't know. I'm only three hearts down. I'm doing pretty good, I think. Again. Yeah, I'm not gonna bother dodging them. It's not worth it. Now we need to ride the spinner to the right, so we have to hit it twice from below to make it go that way. So that isn't annoying enough. <clears throat> well yeah, once we unlock the lock this block here, it's almost as if the spinner isn't there. We have free reign to go in any direction we want. So what's making the point of having it? But okay. But now we But now we're safe to unlock this door. This, this room's deadly too, because getting hit with the laser isn't bad enough. You have tiny, tiny platforms that are moving fast. The laser's going to try to knock you off half the time. You have to jump from onto a platform that's moving, but anyway, there we go. Got the out of the way. And of course I get knocked off, but I should be able to get through here now. Doesn't have a laser. Should be okay. Just being super careful here. There we go. Whoa. Okay. Seems like you need the Pegasus seeds there, but you really don't. I guess I could have pulled them out um, to be safe, but. Got a yo-yo right now. These things out with e ease. I think he's a level too sore when they have a yo-yo, right? Okay, what's in this chest? I wonder. Oh look, that's what I wanted. That chest looks important. Sure it is. Oh, okay, shield. Yeah, if your shield gets eaten on the way here by a shield leader, it's not gonna be fun in, in the rooms like this. Not fun at all. Okay, it's south half, half of that one room where we were just in to get the key. Well, that's interesting. Up another floor. Third floor. Run away, run away, run away. This looks dangerous. Magical boomerang. ring. Da -na -na -na. Another awesome item that wasn't in the previous game. Hold B to control with the flight pass. Oh, hold. See what you mean? You can kind of push up or down while it's in flight. Oops. See, you can kind of spin it around like that. Very cool. Very cool. Reminds me kind of a phantom hourglass, how you can kind of use the stylus to control the boomerang. It's being inspired by this. 
Never has there been a more powerful boomerang than this. Love it. Usually upgraded boomerangs just gives you range, so it goes all the way across, across the screen, but... Man. I'm untouchable, look at me. Okay, I'm not having too much fun. I am out of time, but... We have a mini-boss coming up real quick, so... I'll see you then.